Mm-hmm. Um... Plotting a course immediately, or having a rest? Yeah, uh, before we leave, um, Alexi did manage to get down to the that arms dealer and, uh, uh replenish his, like, stock of bullets and shit, right? He had weeks to do it, I assume so. Yeah, you... If I recall, you bought him out of all his bullets of that type in that calibre. I can't remember how many they were total. It depends on how many is in a box. I figure a pistol box is usually like 50 rounds. Yeah, it's live in the cinema. Yeah, yeah, he probably had two boxes of those really fancy bullets. Well... I buy those. And it is 4.5 parsecs to your next location. This is the longest journey yet. Um, but it's also one of the emptiest. So it's only it's only going to take... It's not going to take two weeks. Slightly under two weeks at FTL speeds. That's the trip to Canaan, or just the next star? That's just to the next stop. Just to the how next long is star. The trip, how long is the total trip? In total Seattle? trip to Canaan is... Part of the heights. Two months. Okay. Yeah, I, was, I wasn't planning on visiting every stop on the way in game by the way that uh, i'm fine with that yeah mm -hmm. I, I honestly was thinking maybe even skip the next one um when we discuss it next session right. might just be an in space adventure you know and then after that i've arrived at canem like a two month skip for us isn't a bad call no lots no, of time it, to... it, it, it's it... fine it's fine out of character it's just Gina is super unhappy about it. <laughs> yeah, Gina will be, for sure. Uh, By the end, she's going through, like, trying to get gambling matches going with everyone. They're all just like, no! <laughs> the last section of the journey will be the longest as well. Uh, so, like, even if you've managed to get your fix for a couple of days at each stop, then when we do the arriving in Canem session, it will have... I mean, the, the, the fix is bad, but it's the months of your lives how many months of your life do you want to spend sitting in a on a bus <laughs> this is this is a fair point as well you could I mean, invest that's in you have shit to do oh, oh that's what i bought oh my god that's what i bought with the last hundred thousand vr setup <laughs> but that's kind of where i was getting at with my questions of how long are we going to be doing this because with all well if it's going to be that long get something <laughs> Yeah, yeah she, if, when she was drugged, she would have bought an, everyone a VR setup and a server. That's what she bought with that 100,000. Yep, there we go. This place, this planet is like TL 8.75. So oh, fancier nice. VR than we have here in present day is available. Um, yeah, you can get like an insane gaming setup for everybody. And Gina's is the smallest and least expensive because you bought... Alexi, the whole server thing and set up computer for it. Uh, he, is Alexi super good with the computers? Not really, no. Not really. I think you yeah, just labeled it as for Alexi <laughs> on the gift for but, whatever reason. But then taken it. Yeah. And like, the reason oh. Hways was slightly larger than Gina's is because it came with a bunch of cables and wireless modem things. <laughs> So they're all basically the same things, but yeah. she was just like, okay. You divided it up so that everyone would have a different gift to open. That's awesome. I think Alexi's the only one here who would actually, who's, who, who's looking forward to this, like, long space journey. <laughs> nice. I have a new pet. She's excited. Mm. New pet. Animal handling in and space is weird, but it's been 800 years. 
we have overcome it. <laughs> uh, have to ask, but I'm hoping out of character the answer is no. Do they have those stasis pod things? For, if we're doing long trips. Yes, that that is something I was going to mention before Terra said about the VR headset. Um, that long-term sleep chambers are an option, and something that you'd come across in the next station, in the next system, if you wanted to. Well, well, we will likely look into that when we get there. Yeah, I think we will do a session for arriving in that system, but next week's session may well be uh, let's see how many systems we can skip over at once, you know? I would just say we say what we do in between. Yeah, I'm, I really don't want to hit everything. Yeah, point unless you have I, I am absolutely good with the idea of like even just kind of using the, the, the text channel to Go yeah, totally. what we do. Planet over the week. Yeah, yeah. I, I would put the next session at, at the place where you want to set the next session. Don't worry about the logistics. Like we can we can hand wave over things that don't matter. Okay. Like if you want to run the next thing on the next planet, great. But if you don't want to run there, don't. Smart. Hmm. I don't think I want to take us straight to Canem. There are a couple of or at least one in space thing I'd like to do. So then fucking do it. Yeah. And Kingdom's gonna be a really built up, really advanced. Like I assume that's the highest TL, highest like wealth level place in the frontier. Yep. So if if we don't want to jump straight to the nah, the top, nah, then yeah. I got plans. I got plans. Yeah, I, I'm definitely down for like a couple adventures on our way to Kingdom. Mm -hmm. like, this is this is a long fucking trip. Yeah. What did I say? Two and a half months. Two months. Yeah. I would definitely be down with using the text channel for sort of a individually, like a rough idea of what what kind of thing we do on planets typically when things aren't going sideways. Mm hmm. Yep. I mean, yeah. Smuggling is actually a really boring job when everything's going well. Mm hmm. Like it's it's just shadier fucking shipping. Mm -hmm. Give me give me a smuggling role now. Um, anyone who's helping in any way. Like, let's let's go for the action rules quickly. Let's take the freight. Can I help back then? Yeah, this is. Let's get your actual. The ACT thing figured out. So Huey, show us your freight cargo. You're moving illicit goods at certain points. Uh, gonna take a bonus for checking time. Like uh, uh, I'll give you a plus one. I'll give you a plus one. Thank Success. My one. Cool. Um, <laughs> Gina and Silver, how are you helping out in the operation when you offload stolen goods? Uh, not. Not. Fine, fuck you, Silver. I suppose you are researching I Orb. <laughs> I, I got stu I got way a lot of other stuff to do, and I'm not helpful at this. Like, everyone's better at this part of it than I am. Give me an animal handling. There are animals involved. The canine-like or uh, the wound? Uh, yeah, canine-like. Canine-like. Okay, okay. So I suspect people don't let Gina help, but here's her attempt. <laughs> well, if I took if I took time, I don't know if that was a thing, but I I make it. I I did give Everoth a plus one. Time. I'll give you a plus one, but so because nose, but... because you only made it because of that, you don't give a bonus to Alexi, but you don't invoke a penalty. And Gina succeeds, no penalty, but a bonus. So Alexi rolls smuggling at a plus three total. The plus one I gave. Oh no, Gina. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Smuggling at plus three. Success by seven. These trips are going to go about as smoothly as they can. You don't need to worry too much about the... Yeah, we will not focus on boring exchanges of goods for money. We've... We're pretty good at it. Yeah. 
Gina does demand at least a long weekend each on each of the planets as we stop, but we also don't have to draw on that. Yeah, I, <laughs> I will look up the planets. Um, I'll make them. It's very easy to make rather uninviting planets. Un mm -hmm. Uninviting planets. Um, how, how especially in the frontier. Zoo, how well does the zoo go over? Are, they, are people excited about new animals? Oh, for sure they will be. Um, it's... It is a ball ache to move lots of certain animals through space. And I don't think... It, it's probably the first time it's been tried, the zoo tells you, when you eventually hand over those dogs. 